this one secure. God, this feels good. Great work. Old Tor is moving into the territory you freed up, and we're already seeing a difference. I can't wait to see what happens when we own it all. Gotta pick it up.
Abandoned ship! We've been boarded! <laughs> Damn things off my ship! You wanna play too? I got a bit of treasure in that chest over there. The weapon you find inside may help with our little imp problem. Ooh. Get off! Let's play. Oh, not another one of these. Summon these imps to serve as my crew. I forgot what a handful they could be. Once aboard, they wouldn't listen to their captain. They ran amok in the bowels of the ship. Pirate voice would that be? Wow. Zinyak's destruction of Earth had a profound impact on the afterlife. To heaven, it was a logistical nightmare. Saint Peter's meticulous nature drove purgatory wait times to unbearable levels. Meanwhile, in hell, where souls in pain were used as currency, it created a new era of prosperity for the wickedly enterprising. This economic boom resulted in the coffers of hell to be overflowing, which in turn piqued the interest of the most notorious man that sailed the Seven Seas. Long had Blackbeard been a thorn in Satan's side, robbing tax collectors on a semi-regular basis. But the promise of an immeasurable fortune drove him to be even bolder. An arrangement was reached. Blackbeard would provide information on strategic targets in exchange for a share of the profit. Johnny, who was interested in murder, not money, happily agreed. I grant ye the ability to summon my crew whenever they're needed. I go way back. Well, six years, which I suppose isn't terribly impressive, but for me it's pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> 